Hello everyone, so today I went out again and of course I've done some more shopping. So uh, yesterday I'll show you uh, some necklaces that I got. This was also purchased yesterday, but I noticed that it was a little bit defective, like uh, it has some scratches on one side. So I decided to go back to the shop and ask for a new one. And when I was there, I can pass on this one, which is so adorable. I already saw it yesterday. I was just saying, no, I can't even buy this one. I can't even buy this one. Today, I bought it. And this is how it looks like. So I think it's really, really cute. It is like uh, with rhinestones. It says love. And it has a little pink rose. They did have also uh, some set of rings uh, matching this necklace. Uh, it was like a set of three and one of them they were all very thin all of them was with the um, one of them was with the little pink rose as you can see here but unfortunately uh, they didn't have uh, the the size so even the bigger one was just too small for me so I couldn't buy it <laughs> then uh, after that I went uh, to get some 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 makeup because I ran out of some stuff that I needed uh, I don't know if I already told you in some of my past videos, but um, when it's about makeup and uh, food and uh, uh, anything that can be used at home, I'm a bit particular because I always try to not get anything which I know for sure that is going to be tested on animals. So testing on animals means that uh, every single component of these products, even if we don't know, is tested in a very cruel way on uh, animals. So imagine cats, dogs, monkeys, any kind of animals, sometimes even horses, uh, are going through very, 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 very bad cruelties because of testing every single piece of that. So wherever you see that some product that you buy says like dermatologically tested, uh, it means that it's, it was tested on animals. And uh, I've seen some videos, I've seen some pictures on some social networks. I got really, really so shocked. And uh, so from my side, of course, I can't go to some people and say, okay, you don't have to buy that. But I promise myself I will do my best to, first of all, not buy anything which I know for sure that is going to be tested on animals, like it was tested on animals. And... Uh, to try my best to promote those uh, products that I know for sure which are not tested on animals. And I can tell you that uh, I stopped eating lots of my favorite snacks because of that. Of course, I'm not going to tell the brands because uh, uh, it, be, uh, it won't be a good thing to do, of course. Uh, and also for the makeup and uh, beauty products like shampoos and uh, hair conditioners. I really suddenly stopped buying most of my favorite ones, which of course were uh, very, very good quality ones. And I was very, very happy about the results. Just because of that, I just, uh, as soon as I see that product on the shelf, I just see in front of me this uh, images of animal suffering. And I can tell you that it's really, really touching. It's really, really cruel. Just imagine that it's going to be done to your dog, to your cat, your, your personal pet that you have at home. You will just feel very, very bad. So I decided from my side, I'm not going to do that anymore. So I got, of course, of course some list of uh, products which are not tested on animals. Uh, usually there is a certification uh, which is uh, like printed on the back of the product. Uh, it's, there is like a logo. Uh, which we, uh, features a rabbit which is like jumping it's surrounded by a circle with stars when you see that one you can be 100% sure that that product was not tested and uh, not even some of the parts or maybe sometimes they say the the final product hasn't been tested on animals this means that the final product was not but some products before were so for all of those of you who may be interested in uh, doing the same, just check out if you see that logo or not. Also, there are some uh, um, companies that probably uh, do not come in this record of people who got the certification. So, 
it doesn't mean that all of them are not testing their products. One of these brands that I'm actually using now, I came to know from their site, just uh, I was passing there on their web and I saw that it was stated clearly that they are not testing on animals. So I just asked for some information and I got confirmed that that is true. So I started buying uh, their brand for my makeup. So today I went and got some products which are these three. I got them from a shop which is called OVS and the brand is Essence. I don't know if you can see the logo. This is the brand. It's called Essence. So, this is a shimmer powder. Like, uh, I ran out of my powder. And I was going to buy the same one. And I just saw this one. It looks like it's a little bit glittery. And it has this uh, kind of embossed stars on it. It's really nice. And also, it's, uh, it's kind of light. <laughs> Sometimes I have the, the problem that when I go to buy foundations or some powders. Or some even um, uh, corrector sticks. They look like... Uh, um, uh, much darker than my skin is so then is that I look like a clown <laughs> so I always try and uh, to see how it is uh, on the skin and this was really 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 pretty and I think it uh, it matches my my light skin I don't know if you can see from the camera the next thing that I got is this mascara Still same brand. It's like Multi Actions Face Lashes Mascara. Uh, it's not waterproof. So you should your eyes should look like that. <laughs> I like these uh, mascaras. I have tasted other ones. Uh, there is a one, I can't remember now uh, what is the difference, there is a one which has like a pink design here, another one has orange, I think the orange one is for smoky eyes, so you combine when you do smoky eyes makeup. Last thing that I got is this uh, smoky eyes brush, I'm going to show you how it looks like. Trying to open it. You can see how it is. It's a little bit tough to open. <laughs> so, yeah, here it is. So, it is like black and purple. It has a sense printed on there. And this is how it looks like. It looks like blue, but it's actually uh, kind of purple, dark purple. And it's very, very, very soft. I'm currently using another one, which is actually not really so soft. It's like a, um, a set of, and there is a eye pencil. One side you have the pencil, and the other side you have the, the brush. I will tell you... Uh, I'll make some kind of review about that as soon as I've tried it out. So, I hope that this information that I got about this uh, product not being tested on animals in any way are correct. Please, if some of you is watching this video, uh, come across some news uh, that this is not true, please let me know. If you do also uh, want to suggest me some products that you know for sure also may be available in your country, never mind. Uh, and you know for sure that they are not tested on animals. It could be not not really only makeup, even snacks, whatever everything. Please let me know because I I will rent to see if I can find it also here. I'm I'm very very really particular about uh, this thing. I do love animals so much, and uh, I mean if these things we don't know, it's okay. But once I know, I can just uh, pass on and say, oh no, never mind. I just keep on buying that thing. I do like it. 
I almost prefer like <laughs> I'm gonna get a shampoo or a conditioner which uh, maybe will dry my hair, will make it fall. <laughs> Never mind. At least I know that it was not tested on animals. So I hope you like this uh, video. <laughs> Uh, sorry if I was uh, a bit long in the description of uh, what I feel about uh, testing on animals, but I'm really, really very particular about that. Also, I've written a note here on my channel that uh, I'm very happy if uh, any companies or anyone wants to send me some products for review. Uh, it can be anything. Basically, it could be Hello Kitty, that I know for sure that's gonna, not going to be tested. But uh, if there's anything like makeup, snacks, whatever thing, I'll be very happy to try that for you and make review. But please, just make sure that it's not tested on animals. That is, uh, I care too much about that. So, thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you very, very, very soon with uh, some more video, maybe some more Hello Kitty haul. <laughs> Bye, have a nice evening.